in this video I'll show you how to get a free dot main domain so uh, first you need to have GitHub education pack GitHub uh, developer pack so if you have not uh, got this then please follow the link in the description to to my previous video I have uh, made a video for you how to get a github education developer pack student developer pack so after applying you will be getting this type of mail from github saying that it has been approved uh, so let's begin uh, to get a dot dot me domain mm. okay I am opening this here follow the link there Uh, click on get your pack make sure that you are logged in in your github account okay so yeah there are different uh, tools available for you in your github developer pack like student developer pack so um, I'm directly going to um, so you can get Microsoft Azure service also so okay so from this name if you can um, you'll be getting a free top level domain dot me domain for a year so for this uh, click on your unique link so this will uh, open a new Okay, this is your email. Uh, okay, let me verify it. Mm, uh, the email has been verified, but uh, we don't. I, I have not created a namesheep account, so let me create one. If you can skip this, if you have, if you already uh, have your namesheep account. Now let's go to our namesheep account from where we can access our domain name we can change the name records like that okay so I have already logged in here uh, without logged in you can register your domain name mm -hmm. so go to your da dashboard okay so sagarbosnet.me is already in my name uh, so mm, you can manage this domain here you can change the name record uh, uh, you can mm, give your name servers information here in costume DNS or you can just use the name chips name chips uh, basic uh, DNS service you can redire redirect it and use uh, various services available here so this is how you can get mm, a free dot me domain so in my next video I'll show you how to host it in a host site in github so these days for hosting a basic site that does not have very advanced uh, features you can easily host it in github and it has very much uh, high power and it can do a very better job uh, so there is a feature called github pages I'll show it in the next video till then uh, enjoy with your new dot me domain thanks for watching bye bye